When I train graduate students and, and when they ask for advice on how to gain some kind of competency in, in Mormon history, um, I always uh, insist that they not just gain a competency in Mormon history, but uh, again, study it in a broader context, um, either a, a geographical context, you know, something about religion in the West, uh, or uh, a comparative context so that they're looking at other religious traditions at the same time. That's partly for practical reasons and partly, I think, just as I said before, that religious studies is uh, a comparative uh, discipline inherently. But the practical reason is that um, they are going to be much more um, uh, able to find jobs if they have competencies that stretch them beyond Mormon studies. And that's, that would be true of any tradition. That's true of Catholicism or Protestantism, that uh, it's good to have breadth um, and it's good to be able to teach sort of a variety of types of topics. So to embed Mormonism in broader contexts is always something I push my students to do.